first. What's happening, people? Feels good to be back. How about you, man? Hello. Just, uh, I want to point something out really fast. I got a phone. Finally, my first phone of all time ever. Blow up my phone, people. I'll shoot you the number later. <laughs> all right. All right. Monster. Oh, a very good movie. Won an Academy Award. It says right there, this is one of the greatest performance in the history of cinema. Roger Ebert himself gives it two thumbs up. Roger Ebert can be a total prick. He's really uh, pretentious with his taste in movies. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you about a movie later that he totally panned, hated it, walked out, didn't even finish the movie. I'll tell you about that later. Um, Bill Finch Boogie, Church of Serial Killer. Church of Music wrote a song about her. Mm -hmm. And that's when I started taking a, a real interest in her. And then you talk about this movie. Yeah. And um, prosthetics were amazing, dude. Yeah. So Charlene Theron and Christina Ricci. Charlene Theron had, under, had undergo a huge transformation. She had to put on like 30 pounds for the role. And uh, prosthetic makeup, pair of fake teeth. Fake teeth? Fake teeth? Yeah, fake teeth. Yeah. yeah. Well, so most of you know the story of Eileen Warner. Some of you don't. She was a, like a woman prostitute who became a serial killer in the state of Florida. Who had a pretty much a uh, rough childhood, getting pregnant at 14 from her brother. Hey, is that true? Not what they say. I heard they were um, experimenting sexually together, but um, I don't hear about any, anything about a pregnancy. I don't know, something like that. Oh, Alright, cool then. Christina Ricci, another, uh, um, she was already coming into her own by then. But she's got to be at least 30 here, right? What do you think? Uh, Late 20s? She was born in 1980, so she was about 24, I think. She was like, she was like 12, 13 when she did that in the family. Hmm. Those are early 90s? Yeah. 91? Or 93? 91, 92, somewhere there. What was um, values? Year after. No, reunion, reunion. 98. I don't know if we have to get it. Yeah, that, that was a completely different cast. Yeah. But Monster, a very good movie, man. It's, it's uh, kind of graphic. But figuring you know, out it's uh, based on a serial killer, so what'd you expect? There's no sex in it, though. I mean, mm -hmm. it's not it's not graphic in that in that respect. Mm -hmm. But it's a very good film. I I love it. Perfect. Ten out of ten. Two thumbs up. One of my favorite films. I recommend you see it. A woman director too. How do you like that? Mm -hmm. That's a rarity. Yeah. No respect to the female the denomination out there, demographic, whatever. Mm -hmm. It's up. What's up? Check it out.